Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to make maple syrup uh, candies. So to start this, you're going to need a um, pot, stainless steel pot with some nice high sides on it. We have got a digital thermometer here. You could use a candy thermometer and that would work fine. Um, we've got a rubber mold to put our candies into when they're ready. And we've got a few um, rubber spatula and a stirring spoon measuring cup and of course some pure maple syrup. So to start this, we are going to pour two cups, which is 500 milliliters of pure maple syrup into the pot. And um, we are going to turn this up pretty high to get it started. To make maple syrup hard candy, we are going to need to take this syrup and just boil it all the way up until it gets to 118 degrees Celsius. So when we get a little bit closer, we'll come on back and see what that looks like. So here we are at a nice boil and um, you can see the bubbles breaking the surface. Lots of nice evaporation happening there. And that water is going to evaporate off and leave us with a more concentrated sugar solution, which is going to uh, help us make our candies. We are at 103.9 degrees Celsius, so we've got a little ways to go. Okay, so we are just about at 118 degrees Celsius, and what we're going to do is, I just want you to actually take a notice, and you can see how the bubbles have changed a little bit in that syrup from, it, from when it was boiling before. Um, so here we are at 118 degrees Celsius. So I'm going to turn the heat off, and I'm just going to move it right over here to cool. And we're going to leave the syrup cool there, undisturbed. We're just going to let it chill out until it gets down to about 85 degrees Celsius. And then we'll come on back and stir it up and make some candy. Okay, so we are at 85 degrees Celsius. And um, I'm just going to take the pot off, bring it on over here. And what we're going to do is we're going to start stirring it. You can see inside the pot now it's pretty, uh, it's a nice thick mixture. And we're going to keep stirring it. It's uh, a little bit of a tricky job at this point uh, because you have to stir it until you can start to feel a little bit of sugar crystals happening in it. And sometimes you'll be able to see streaks in the, um, in the syrup, but most of the time you'll actually just be able to feel it with your spoon. So it doesn't usually take too long, but what's going to happen as soon as we start to feel that, um, I'm going to start pouring it into the mold, and by the time we get to the end of the uh, of the molds, you can kind of see it happening there now. So I'm going to start pouring. By the time we get to the end of the molds, it's going to be quite a thick mixture. And you can probably see it. Oh, goodness, it's starting to set up in the... Um, pan already in the pot. You see it there? And I'm just going to keep pouring. I'll fix that up in the, when I get to the end. But you can already see it's starting to solidify in there. And we'll scrape that out so it'll get into there and be fine into a mold. We're just going to get this in here roughly and then I will smooth it out on the top. Alright, so I'm just going to take my spatula and smooth it out so I can fill all those cavities. And ta-da! So this will take a little bit to set up. It's quite hot still. Um, this mold holds six. It has 60 cavities, and there's three left. So this um, this batch made 57 
maple sugar candies. We'll come on back in probably 15 or 20 minutes and we'll be able to pop them out of the molds then. Okay, so our candies have now hardened and we're just going to pop them out. And you're gonna see some beautiful maple sugar candies. Enjoy.